Okay, so check this out. I'm going to get y'all up to the minute with uh, what's going on in the manosphere, okay? So if you don't know what the manosphere is, you need to look up the book called The Rational Male by Rollo Tomasi. It's a fucking instant classic. And uh, everybody that has read that book has, has decided that they are experts in relationship psychology, so they decide to psychoanalyze everything, right? And it falls into the category of red pill or blue pill. You're either an alpha male or a beta male, right? And so the MGTOW movement has decided that Will Smith is in fact a beta male. And not only is he a beta male, but he's a fucking cuck face, right? So we're going to get into this. Because if you're a cuck face, then you can't claim to be Big Willie style, right? So we're going to psychoanalyze some red table talk. Let's get into this. Um, you need to say clearly what happened. As far as what? You and I decided we were gonna take our space and what happened. Yeah, and then I got into an entanglement with August, that's what I said. An entanglement? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. A relationship. Yes, it was a relationship, absolutely. I was. Okay, so she got into an entanglement, entanglement with August, and that's a relationship you were looking for. I just wanted to feel good. Mm -hmm. It. Had she just wanted to feel good. Okay, that's why she cheated on Will, because she wanted to feel good. It had been so long mm -hmm. since I felt good. Yeah. Okay. Let's psychoanalyze MGTOW, this chick. So, she hadn't felt good in so long. Why? Because Will does not, in fact, have a big willy. You have to read behind, be, between the lines with what she's talking about. When she says it had been so long, right? that she hooked up with August because it had been so long. She's trying to fucking tell Will, hey man, I tried to tell your short dick have an ass when we got married. It's, you are gonna have to go deep to please me. I was that, that I didn't have the girth that it was gonna take to ride with I you didn't, through. Yeah, I didn't know if you would be willing to find the deep capacity to love me. Yeah. All right, again, he just admitted what did he say about not having the girth? And then she said, yeah, exactly. I didn't know if you had the deep capacity. So, you just got exposed as a cuck face who, in fact, does not have a big willy style, right? Yeah. How am I doing? You doing great. Mm -hmm. All right. You're not doing that great, Will, because you know what the problem is now? Now you got the whole fucking MGTOW movement calling you a cuck face, right? Because you claim to have a big willy style, right? But you know who? We got a question. Who is the big willy really? Is it Will Smith or is it Willie D from the Ghetto Boys, right? Because if you think about it, if you... We Put it in a juxtaposition, right? If you were to cross compare and say, hey, who's got the real Big Willie style? Is it Will Smith or Willie D from the Ghetto Boys? I would have to agree that Will Smith is a cuck face who got exposed by his own wife. And Willie D, on the other hand, tried to warn the fucking whole world about bald-headed hoes from day one. And he also tried to say on another album, because uh, he had a fucking song called Clean Up Man. It was like kind of like that song Clean Up Woman, but it was Clean Up Man. And he tried to say to the world that if you don't take care of your business, that somebody else will, right? I got this album. You know what I mean? I have this album to this day. So... Who's a who's the real Big Willie? Will Smith or 
Willie D from the Ghetto Boys, right? Who 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 you going to take fucking marital advice from? You know what I'm saying? A cuck face or a motherfucker who tried to warn the world about ball-headed hoes and clean up men from day one. Yeah, I'd say that the fucking real Big Willie is Willie D of the Ghetto Boys. Ball hit ho. What you see, D? What, 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 what you see, D? I see some ball hit ho.